cookies. Delicious cookies. Oh, my God. Back. Beat. Back. Well, you know, I worked on the first film, mm -hmm. and, you know, everybody loved Edna in, in that movie. And this movie, there's so much more screen time for Jack Jack, and everything that we were doing with him was just so fun. The raccoon scene is actually something that was held over from the first movie. So we got to do that, and then, you know, everybody on the film was just loving the two characters together. So it seemed like kind of a no-brainer. Some of the guidelines were, uh, what could we possibly do? <laughs> what, what, from, in time and, and, and uh, whatnot. But then there was just simply kind of what, what powers did uh, the filmmakers kind of want to want to present and what were true to the character. Yeah, initially, the, the, you know, there was sort of this, this rule, like, we can't have any new powers, right? Because we're on a strict timeline, budget, and then as we were putting it together, we're like, we, we need to have new powers. And I talked to Brad about it, and he, he's like, absolutely, we have to show some new stuff in this. The water was pretty challenging. Yeah, the water looks, I mean, every, anything that we hadn't done before would be a challenge because we had a tight schedule to hit and so normally a lot of those take time to develop and get the look right and get a satisfactory look. Um, I think the the dynamo just getting the look right is was coordinated between lighting and effects and a lot of back and forth there. The smoke was one that came together really quickly but it takes time to refine it to get it to look pleasing as it dissipates you know because the computer will do certain things with it um, and then that's when you have the team go in and they, you know, they very specifically go in and they, they handcraft each frame. They had a blast. Let's show him how fabulous you look. <laughs>